Welcome back. If you're new around here, then we're Rick and Kira, and these are our kids, Piper, Jack, and Teddy. We've been living on the road for almost two years now, taking in over 14 countries across Europe. But this year, we have ventured over to a new continent and are now exploring Morocco. If you're not new to our channel and you were left wondering at the end of last week's episode why we dashed off to the airport, then you're about to find out. I see it in your eyes. Yeah, I can read the signs. You need to get away. It's time we make a change. All right, we just arrived at the airport. I suppose you're wondering where we're going. The answer is nowhere. We're here to pick someone up and you'll see who that is a bit later on. Right, I think I see the man. Here he is. Like a big man, the, the, the boss. Here he is, look. There he is, look. <laughs> Who's that? Can you come with me? No, come in. Give him a cuddle. Go home. No, I'll carry on. I'll come over. Daddy, go with you. Give him a cuddle. Hello, buddy. How are you? Fish. You all. How are you doing? Yeah, that's about it. Hi, Daddy. See you. Couldn't get in. What? I couldn't get out of the airport. Why? Because they said, lost. what's your name of your hotel? I said, I'm not staying there. I'm staying with my son. Yeah. Where? In a motorhome. Because mm. I had to make an excuse yeah. out because you wouldn't send me the address. Because they do that now, don't they? they no, you haven't. You. Oh, right. They question you. Yeah. So they wouldn't let you out? No. Oh, right. Oh. Well, we nearly lost you then. It's a good job you're here. <laughs> anyway, I think I've had enough of you. <laughs> it's nice seeing you. OK. okay. <laughs> Unfortunately, I can't, can't jump on the flight and go home. You know, I'll have to stay oh. with you. So it wasn't technically true and Rick said we weren't actually going anywhere because we have come to the centre of Marrakesh and we're going to be staying in a traditional Riyadh. So we've just arrived, we've got a taxi from the airport and we're now wandering the streets trying to find our Riyadh because you can't get there by car. So we've had to get our taxi to drop us off at the nearest location and we're now just wandering around, see if we get lost or how easy it is to find. Oh, is that a shop just over there? Just literally outside our oh. place. Perfect. So, it's not far from the restaurant. That's the one. Okay. Shukran. Thank you. Oh. <laughs> what time is it? That's a light. Hi. Hello. How are you? <laughs> Very well. Thank you. Go on in. Can you say hello? Can you say hello? Hi. Hi. Can say hello? Hi. How are you? Hi. Oh, look at this. This is lovely and cool, are You've done that before, haven't you? <laughs> <laughs> You've done that before, that's yeah, exactly. why. Many times. Uh, <laughs> many, many times. I, I was watching you, I thought, go on, go yeah, on, just do it. it. <laughs> so I should probably fill you guys in, because when we arrived yesterday, we stopped rolling the cameras. So if you haven't guessed already, Rick's dad has come to see us here in Marrakesh. So he's come to spend uh, a week with us here in this accommodation. Yesterday was also Rick's birthday, so we stopped the cameras and just enjoyed a bit of catching up and celebrating. We found a lovely restaurant, went out for a nice meal, but unfortunately 
<laughs> it did take a turn for the worse. Jack started feeling sick, took him to the bathroom, and he collapsed. There was a, a big panic from me. He's done it plenty of times before, but every time still causes a panic, as any parent would probably um, would probably know your child falls on the floor and collapses like that when they're poorly, and yeah, it's not nice. Um, but yeah, he's fine. He's absolutely fine. He's done it before plenty of times, but it's usually pain related, and this wasn't pain related. This was just, he felt sick and collapsed. Not sure what it was. We did have a really few difficult days in Marrakesh at our campsite though, because the weather, we had a bit of a heat wave. So temperatures reached 35 degrees. So it was really, really, very, very hot. So we're wondering whether the heat caused that. Possibly, we don't know, but it's all good now. So everything is fine, nothing to worry about. So yeah, today we're gonna go out and head into Marrakesh, go wander the streets. We've had a lovely breakfast here in our Riyadh. Um, our Riyadh's beautiful and we will get around to doing a little tour for you guys. We have breakfast every day, so our housekeeper comes in every morning and cooks us breakfast, which is absolutely beautiful. So we've just eaten, really full tummies, nice and content, and we're gonna go out into Marrakesh and just have a wonder. We haven't got an intention of exactly where we're going. We're just gonna go and see what we can find. So we're actually staying in the old town, which we didn't actually know when booking the Riyadh. We didn't have a clue what was about the place because Google wasn't really telling me much. But I'm so glad we actually stayed here because it is stunning, absolutely stunning. So today we're heading off, we're gonna try and find uh, the Medina and the Souk at uh, a square called Tinsmith's Square. Ted, that's your one, buddy. I know what it tastes like. It's a lemon one, you chose a lemon one. It's a bit strong. <laughs> <laughs> Is it nice? It's strong though. Yeah. Right, so day three in Marrakesh and we have just arrived at Gemma Elfna, which is the main square here in Marrakesh. This is the place you see on all the This is where everyone videos. goes. Yeah, yeah this yeah. is where it's, where it's happening. Um, we've already just spotted um, monkeys on leads. Obviously, we don't like that sort of thing. No, you can um, hear the snake charmers as well. Yeah, you can, can't you? So we've literally just this second arrived, so we're going to go and have a look around and just see how crazy it is. Have a little look at the souks, find the souks. Yeah. And have got, a little look. We, we do have a few things on our shopping list as well, so yeah. we'll see what we can find. Already having people come up to us. They try and hand the kids, you know, little uh, musical instruments. So we've uh, carefully instructed the kids, you know, don't take anything that they give you. It's just their tactic to try and sell you it. But um, yeah, it's interesting. But I think the blue is a bit more vibrant. Yeah, you want to go? And what size? Because some of them are bigger, like that one's a bigger one. That it's one's. Good size. Yeah, that's. So, I'm in green. Yeah. I think that looks like small. Green. Or cool. Small. I oh, think you want. Do you have the what blue? What about. Like that one's a slightly bigger one. Yeah, I yeah. have in blue, yeah. This size. Yeah? Yeah. Yes. Uh, where does this one go? Uh, <laughs> yeah, <laughs> thank, you. thank you. Thank you. Yeah. And what does the hand sign mean? Sorry, what does the hand mean? What hand does it resemble? For good luck. Good luck. Good luck. Oh, yeah. fabulous. There you go. Fabulous. <laughs> <laughs> Who's talking to me? Fabulous. Don't take the wind out of me. Why not? Why? Oh, yes, that's good luck. Uh, gold colour or silver colour? Yeah. Uh, I think I like oh, the silver. Silver is nice, isn't it? That yeah. That means five stones, yeah. yeah. How many get them? This is 250. 250 dirham. Yeah, yeah. Beautiful yeah. pieces. No, no. Yeah, I do have much colour. Yeah, no, no, no. Yeah. 250 dirham. Yeah. 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 Ye
<laughs> how, how much is one of these? Uh, these 300. 300? It's the quality. Yeah. Hey, have a look, uh, maybe it is. Too much. Yeah, 300 is too much. It's the big one, 100 dirham. But the quality is not safe. Yeah. Big size, 100 dirham. Yeah. No, I can't do 300. This is the quality, how much you can yeah. find? Yeah. Like, I'd do 100. No, 250 is okay. No. No. no, I think it's, 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 I think Look it's the too quality. Too much. Very yeah. nice. Yeah. 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 120. My final price 190 because you are forced to business. 190 yeah. is okay. No, it's okay. We'll have it. Cheers, thank you. What's your Lay final price? You? 120. 120. Oh, Come on. Your price a yeah. Maximum. 130. <laughs> <laughs> that's it. No, that's yeah, it. That's, that's it. it. I can't go anymore. I can't okay, go anymore. 150. Because you're no, 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 no. Okay, 140. No, no, no sorry. You say 140. I said 130. No. Oh, okay, 130. Yeah, okay, 130. we'll do it. Yeah, good. Our negotiations paid off there, didn't they? <laughs> they did a little bit, yeah. <laughs> we got that for 130, which will... Down from what? Uh, down from 300, and I think it's probably about 11 pounds, maybe? Yeah, we'll pop it up on screen. Yeah, we'll pop it up on screen. It's maybe 10 pound something. So that's quite nice, happy with that. So we're now just entered one of the million bag shops that there are here in Marrakesh. <laughs> well, everywhere in Morocco, to be honest, because Piper's looking for a bag. So she got all her birthday money um, the other week um, from family back home, and she's now looking to spend it. So handbag is up on her list. So we'll see, see what she gets. On the negotiations. £215. Yeah. Yeah. So starting at 200 15 quid about. What's your best price? Ooh. Don't start with that. It's a present. This, this man used to go into motorbike garages and sit there and haggle just for fun. So let's see if he's still got any. <laughs> I'm sitting back. I'm watching. He used to be the master. He used to go to Marks and Spencers and haggle. That is all this color. Because the, yeah. this one in the first color is similar like this, natural. Yeah. I make it just the oil, I come in this color. How much is your best price? Good price. Mm. Come on, really 250 dinners. Yeah, yeah. Well, like. I think it was 208, but now I thought you said 250. It's going up. <laughs> because all this is working head mixer, <laughs> not in machine. You know, in your country, small bags seem like this in plastic. No. I'm, not, I'm not oh, stepping in. No, you have to. I'm not stepping in. This is a cord leather. Not my money. <laughs> this is cow leather. Yeah. Can you check 200? Uh, I mean, 280, that's for her because she said this, I told you to, okay, this is the price for her. So what? I said, so Stan was 280. Yeah, Stan was 250. No, you can't. No, 250 too much. Yeah. Two bucks. I'm going to give it to her. You want to no. love the, excuse me, yeah. you want to love the leather. Yeah. This is working hand it looks, Look. It's lovely, but Looks good. Too yeah. much. So, wait, is this yeah. leather, double leather, inside yeah. and outside? Mm -hmm. This is working yeah. hand mills. Not yeah. too much, you know, like it's something much similar like this. Yeah. If it was started at 280, yeah, I'd be going in a, a 150. Yeah, you need to yeah. yeah, I think 200. Judge on what he's not going to pay. 200 or. Yeah. Yeah. Give me 230 because you're first cast for today. Yeah. Yeah. No. What's your best price? Yeah. Yeah. This made me too happy for this. Yeah. Yeah. Sorry, yeah. okay, I'll choose on this. Yeah. 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 Needs to start walking now. Needs to start walking. Yeah. I don't try and get my Don't trap me. Did it did it <laughs> there we go, he's got it. So he got it from 280 down to 200. Yeah. He could have got that in Marks and Spencer's years back. <laughs> he did all right. Are you happy? Yeah. Are you happy with that? Yeah. Okay. You prefer that is a little cheap. I never find a little bit of the lamp for that. Okay. Your price? Okay. Okay. okay, what do you tap price, yeah. man? I like we, to we, make her happy. That's yeah. why, because you're first people today in my shop. Yeah. I like to do, touch money. We can do 100. Or, 100. Yeah. 150. Happy? No, no, I can't do 150. Too much. Cheers. Yeah. No, no, no. No, no.
You good? 100. Is yeah. he playing us? Guys, wait, wait there. Yeah, B, brother. Pay. Yeah, B. Thank you. Right, wait, boys, you can't. No, boys. We're in a busy place. We need to stay together, okay? Yeah, come and see daddy here. Do you have a hundred or yes, 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 a hundred? Yes, yes, that's change. That is change. That is one hundred. Thank you. Thank you. So, got another pair of my trousers there. So that brings me up to a total of four pairs of those lovely trousers. Well, these trousers. ones are linen and not cotton. Yeah, the other two one, are cotton. These ones are linen, which is lovely. But we have got our tactics sorted, like to a fine tee. You've just got to walk away and you've got to be happy Boys, that stop. you might not get Boys. it. But so far, every time we've walked away, we're getting it for that lower price that we want him. So it's, all good. it's, um, oh, no, no, no. it's paying off. And I think after two months here, more than two months, we've got it down to a fine art. Been selling things are well. What facts belong, it's hard to say. The pattern is so hard to tell. But we're together, that's our game. So after disappearing into the sook and buying a few bits, we're back on the main square now and you can already see that it's transforming so apparently this place completely transforms at night time you get all the pop-up street food restaurants and it looks entirely different um, but already it's just coming to life isn't it just like so busy it is a manic manic place <laughs> it it's really good is. i enjoyed walking through the souk yeah yeah the souk was nice that was and then you're back out here in the in the sunshine so we were in the shade um, and yeah, there's lots more to see, so it's quite nice. So we're going to have another another look round. What do you think, Ted? Let me see. Yeah. You can't just walk off, buddy. <laughs> yeah. Do you like it? Let's have a look with the buttons. More good than good. He needs to lose that belly. <laughs> It's more than yours, Oh, you think it's better than mine, do you? There we go. So the first shop that we saw that jacket in, it was just a bit too small. And, we, you know, he knocked us right down on the price um, to 50, actually. Um, so we'll see what this guy says. But this one's a much better fit. So, And it's red, which is Ted's favourite colour. So we'll just see. We're looking for like 70. Yeah, that's pretty fair. Yeah. If you want 80, you know. It's the same it? uh, How much was your price? 180 did I want. No, no, no so that's more than yours. Oh, yeah. I paid no, I paid no, I paid less for mine. How much was that? Pay 100 max, you said. Oh, how much? She said 100 max. 100, 100, 100 max. Yeah. 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 And if this small one, send that say. Yeah, no, it's uh we do 100, 100 doom. Ready to walk? No. 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 Come on, guys. We'll find the next place. We'll get, we'll get one somewhere. Yeah, just 100 is fine. We're not going to see the monkeys. Yeah. No, failed attempt again. Failed attempt. But he said he went down to 150, but 150 you can get a big, proper one, big one for that. Yeah, we've had a bit of intel from our lovely housekeeper. So she is giving us some intel about the sort of prices that we should be paying for certain products. And before we left this morning, we said that we were looking for uh, a jacket like Rick's and not like Jack's got, but in Teddy's size. And she said pay max 100. So she was saying 180, which was more than yours. Yeah, so. it is. But we are on the main square now, the Jammer yeah. FML square, and which point it's tourist galore. So yeah. they might, um, They're gonna try they might up the price a little yeah. bit here. Uh, but yeah, 150 was just too much. You can get a big one for that. So. Well, we've seen everything we came here to see, so we're going to try and hunt down a taxi. See if we can get back. Right then guys, so let us show you around our Riyadh. And I'll start here, in the kitchen. So here. Which we haven't cooked in. <laughs> we haven't cooked in because we are on holiday and it's a bit messy with Pringles, Doritos, flaming Hot. Have you had them before? Right, let's have a little look. Let's take you on a tour. Right, so heading into the main area. So we've got a dining table in the middle. 
with the most beautiful sort of terrace thing, don't know what you would call it. But it's open to the sky. There is a roof uh, cover over it, but it is raining at the minute and it's leaking a little bit. This is one of the living rooms. Now we've called this the kids area. It looks lovely and tidy, but believe me, five minutes ago, it wasn't. So I said it is raining, the boys have got their tops off. Teddy, what are you up to? Washing my hands. Washing your hands in the puddle, the drip. That's coming from up there. And we've also got a drip here on the leaf. Nice entrance bit. This is the adult area. Father watching the news. Catching up on all the global problems. Right, first floor. Kids' bedroom. How you doing, Pip? Good. What are you watching? Is it cake? Is it cake? Is it cake? <laughs> so kids' bedroom, you've got a double and a single bed. The pillows here, if you're wondering, are for Teddy, because if he rolls out, which he has done once, he then lands on those, you know, without landing on the concrete floor. En suite, beautiful. Look at that lovely shower. Look at that bowl, absolutely stunning. Okay, through here, and you've got this like, little, nice little balcony area. Hello, there's Kira. <laughs> Taking some B-roll. Mine and Kira's room. Absolutely lovely. Nice double bed. And again, these lovely bay windows which open out right over looking down and also looking up to a very wet Marrakesh. And we've got our own ensuite. Lovely shower, look at that. That is a van life as dream, that is. Does anyone else love it when they go around someone's house on holiday or anywhere like that where they can um, have a shower or a bath? And then you've got this top floor. We'll go out there, we'll open it up and I'll show you. I'll actually turn some lights on. There we go. Okay. Oh. Very miserable Marrakesh. So out here, and I'll stand just inside, but we had nice seating area there, nice seating area there. We've put all the cushions away for them. So we're out on the roof. And then in here is my dad's room, another double with uh, an ensuite. Who, who bets that's gonna cave in all the way down into our house. What are you up to, Mr. Jack? Having a shower? Right, let's get back inside. It is minging. And there we go, guys. That is our Riyadh in Marrakesh. This is Riyadh Kasbabush. Had to look at Kira then, because I had a little memory blank. But yeah, Riyadh Kasbabush. We are in the Kaspar area, so it's the old town. And we would definitely recommend coming to the old town because you can walk out full of character, you got some shops, got some restaurants. It's only, depending on how fast you walk, it takes us 20 minutes to walk to the um, Jama Efna Square, so the big square. There's also another smaller square here called the, oh, Tar what's it called? Tinsmith Square. Tinsmith Square. So it's a smaller square. Um, and yeah, we would, we would definitely recommend coming to this area because it is not the usual Marrakesh, there's still lots of tourists about, obviously, but it is, it gives an extra bit of character to the area, that's our opinion. So yeah, this is an amazing place. But the big question is, is that ceiling gonna cave in? It's tied down. Yeah. On, it's tied down on this edge, not that edge, but that's a lot of water. Like, if I put my hands in my lap, it's a good four inches
your feet. Ah! It's obviously designed to do this, but there's a lot of water falling in that roof. And this side here is strapped down. Oh, it is, isn't it? This side's strapped down, but yeah. that side ain't strapped down. There's nothing on it. Oh. So, it's all right. And then all this water. Yeah. I was wondering where does all the water go? It goes in this room. In the room? Yeah. There's a drain. There's a drain in the corner. Our time at the Riyadh has come to an end. How do you feel? It's all done. It's been a wicked week. It's, it's been incredible to spend time with Dad, obviously. Yeah. Um, but I'm looking forward to going back to the lorry. We are, we're really excited to get back to the lorry. It's just home comforts, isn't yeah, it? I it think is. I think everyone's like that when they go on a holiday. It's not probably not just us. You sort of you get to the end of your week and you're you're sort of ready to go back to your home and obviously for us our home is Tory, yeah. so So get back, get the kettle on, sit on the sofa. Tea and sit and chill out. <laughs> probably because we've got rain. Yeah. We have just come out of the Riyadh, it's been pouring it down all morning and so we've just had a little break in the weather um, and we've gone right let's quickly go and get our taxi now so it's very chance that it might start pouring it down again very soon. Back here, raining and um, it's pretty empty there's no one about now it's totally different to when we left last week because it was just jam-packed out. There are so many pictures to choose from now. If we arrived now at this campsite, we'd have no problem. But yeah, I'm just trying to navigate round. We're almost back. We're almost back, guys. Oh, man. All right, you've got the keys. Yeah. I'll grab them. There we go. Oh, you were dancing with me then. Tori, oh, Tori. I wasn't dancing. Tori. Grab the keys. And then the ladder's in there as well. Oh no. Uh, Why? We need one of those fold out ladders, don't we, babe? No. Yeah. Our ladder is perfectly fine. Jack, can you pull the handle towards me? The handle. Pull the handle. That, yeah. yeah, that's it. Pull. Good. Okay. Welcome home, guys. <laughs> okay, wait there, Jack. Wait there, wait there, wait there. Let me launch this in and get the steps. Yeah, let's go. Are you happy? <laughs> I think we're all quite happy yeah. to be home. Just the only thing it, it could be if it was bright sunshine. That would make it better, right? Oh, what's yeah. Because then we could play outside. Yeah, and be like, yay, it's sunshine. Let's go outside and have some food. Wait, 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 wait. Oh. I know, but... Let's make sure we get our shoes off because we're going to have muddy, muddy Go shoes. Go on, Ellie, you get it, guys. Yep. Oh. Very hot days, it might be a bit smelly, but it smells delicious. <laughs> it's all good.